All right, so I apologize. Uh, this one, uh, the video kind of went away while I was working on it, so <laughs> bear with me. Um, this is the Corinthian column. Uh, again, I started out very lightly. As you can see up here, this is the top. I just kind of very lightly took my chalk across the top, smeared it with my finger, get a nice gray, and I started to go back in now at this point, and I'm adding my highlights, and I'm using with my chalk, blending a little bit. Uh, obviously where I press the hardest is where it's going to be the brightest. And I'm using my eraser, and I'll show you in a second, to bring out my darks. My blacks, where it's the blackest, is where I'm going to erase the most because underneath all that chalk is my paper. So, that's kind of where I'm at right now. I can use my eraser to blend, but also to remove. Just want to keep cleaning it. I use my pants. You may not want to do that because you have nicer clothes than I do. So, <laughs> um, that's where we go. All right, see how that's starting to swerve in and out. It looks like some of them's coming are coming towards you. Some of them are going away. That's what we want. That's what makes it interesting. We've got our parts in the middle that are. with the chalk the brighter that highlights gonna be you can always come back and hit it with your eraser to blend take it back a little bit so just keep building all we're doing is layer adding layers and we're building up to make something beautiful At least that our moms will think be are beautiful. Moms always think everything we do is beautiful, don't they? Alright, we're getting there. We're getting there. So this is kind of not as dark as these over here. So I added some more chalk. Blend with my trusty super awesome pencil type ruler I believe some of you may have some have one already and then as we go we start to see there's certain parts that are darker than others we can use our eraser to bring that up and we've got parts that are brighter than others and that's what our chalk's for and then our fingers and our erasers are for making some of these parts that are kind of in between look good again like I always say don't worry about making mistakes don't worry about making it look just like mine that's not what we're looking for here You start start light build up as you go looks pretty good actually kind of pleased <sighs> you can use your chalk to really help here depending on how hard you press come back with your fingers Yeah, get 
messy, not too messy. You don't want to upset your parents. But it's okay. It's okay. Mr. Pfeiffer says it's all right to make a little bit of a mess when we're doing art. Especially when we're working with chalk. I don't know if some of you are using your pastels. But a lot of what I'm doing, you can use your pastels for as well. So as you can see, this thing's starting to take shape. This one's a lot fancier than any of the other ones we've done. So, you gotta watch where you put your hands because I'm starting to smudge. <laughs> everything you got. Remember, this doesn't need to look like a photograph because if you wanted it to look like a photograph, then you'd just use a photograph. So that's why I prefer hand drawn things because they're not perfect. There's a little bit of it as we work into these and we do these, there's a little bit of us that shows up in here, part of who we are appears. And you can't really, well, good photographers can do that. But there's something about getting dirty, making a little bit of a mess that really, I really, really enjoy about drawing. So this is a little bit more, see how it's a little bit fancier, it's starting to come together. Come back in. Just that little bit of black here by taking it out really starts to make this white part come towards you make it pop so these are all our Corinthian. It's a good start. Can I make it? Ah, made it. Let's go back and make it look a little bit fancy. see what you guys do we're getting there don't worry again about making mistakes don't worry about making it look exactly like mine I want to see what you can do all right take it easy fifth and sixth grade I love you guys right and girls sorry <laughs>